Eastern stand in the High Sense Arena, still bathed in brilliant sunshine. The court surface itself in shade. Little light cloud overhead. But a perfect summer's afternoon. Not going perfectly for the number 10 seat, David Nelbandia. Set all. Down a break, though, in this uh, third set against Lu Yen Sun. New balls and uh, his serve. A little bit better execution here with the court open than what we saw on uh, set point in the second set. Fifty Well, tactics here for Nelbandian. Cut out the unforced errors and... Uh, take up the attack a little more to his opponent, put the pressure on him, try and make him play above himself. Thirty fifteen. And for Lou, stay positive. Four face, that uh, helps in that regard. I think we can see that Lou, uh, as I said, stayed positive and he uh, must keep taking the match up to Nalbandian. Don't just uh, go back into your shell and hope that uh, Nalbandian is going to make uh, lots and lots of errors. He has been making errors, but uh, Lou needs to stay positive. No, now Bandy didn't really have to move much to this, just had to bend his knees and meet the ball early as he did. Right back point. Well, that's a bitter disappointment. Some. Just his first double fault. And it uh, gives the break back to Nalbandian. Yes, and I think a little bit of nerves coming in there. Uh, just having trouble throwing the ball up straight. It's always an indication that uh, you're feeling a bit edgy if you can't uh, get that ball up straight. Thirty-nine. 
<laughs> Man, you're taking a long look. Asking the lines first. Not understanding the call of the left baseline. Ball was calling. Was it? Yes. Well, well in. 30-15. Mr. Nabadian has two challenges for me. Let. First of all. The forehand from Lou tends to break down in the rallies. He doesn't hit as much top spin as, uh, well, particularly as Nalbandian does, and a lot of the players. A little bit flat. Serve a bit short, Faulty, and uh, Lou not needing to make any movement at all, and he was well inside the baseline when he hit it. Yeah, no money. Oh, holds serve. He leads three-two. But on the second last point, we saw a short serve there. No uh, is really two. punished by Lou. So break a serve each way so far in this uh, third set where it once at all. Now Bandian trying to lift his uh, the level of his play. Fifteen. We see many net cords on this uh, arena here. This high, that the high sense arena go over for the players. Test me. Yeah, so that one 15, <laughs> made 30. the ball sit up for him, really. Take it easy, okay? Two in a row in that rally. And uh, almost uh, this one here is right near the top of the net as well. That's you. A couple of big points in the match now here with uh, Albany just having 15.30. Lou comes up with the big ace. Good play from him. But an opportunity again, 30 all for Nalbandian. Had the opening too. Oh. 
ย่างลูกเ Well, I don't think I've seen a good player struggle as much as Nell Bandian has today. The number 10 seed, well-traveled, well-credentialed player Nell Bandian, and he's just not able to come up with the The shots. He had a passing shot opportunity there, then just made an error on the return on the next point. <laughs> Missing return, return from Lou. Draws an error from Nelbandian. Doesn't need any help, Nelbandian. He's coming up with enough errors of his own. Return. He's in all sorts of trouble 50, with the return, 50. and then uh, was able to hit the winner there in the open court. Faults to break points for Lou. Well, he's challenging this call. He thought it was out on the baseline, and I'm not sure that he's correct. He's not. So that's the break of serve, and Lou leads by four games to three. Then the number 10 seed is in deep trouble. Time. Well, I would have described the look on Nalbandian's face on that change of ends as a look of resignation. Shell shocked is another word that yes. comes to mind. Yeah. Yeah, bad decision on that last point, that break point to not play the ball and go to Hawkeye. He lost the appeal, lost, lost. the game. Mm. Fifteen. Can't take a trick. The, uh, the top spin there. 36 unforced errors for now, Bandian. 35 for Lou, so that's pretty much line ball. But winners, 27 for Lou, just 18 for now, Bandian.
have set that point up well, moving now, banding around. He so might have come to the net on a shot earlier in that rally, but in the end, uh, played a great little angle volley. Well, when he walked on the court for this match, Nel Bandian, I referred to him as the Pampas Bull. Lou is now the Picador. Lou just getting his weight uh, on the back foot that time, falling away from the shot. And behind the baseline, it's tough then to get it over the net, as we saw. Don't really want your weight falling back. Things tighten up a little. Mm. for uh, Nabal to get Nobody back in this set. And a little bit of tightness coming from Lou. He's trying to steer that one. point from Lou then after playing the little bit of a nervy backhand into the net on the previous point then really hitting freely Uh, 
Narbanyan. Good short back swing there. It was, and a good example of moving forward to the shorter second serve then. And you feel that uh, it wouldn't take a lot of, a uh, lot more, a lot for Nalbanian to lift his game here and run away with it, or not run away with it, but go on and win this match. Seeded 10 in the tournament. He's not playing his best tennis, but he's still well in it. Blue, from his point of view, is playing really well. is we've been saying this is three all in the first set it wouldn't take much for now bandy to lift his game and take control of this match exactly the question at the other end is does lou have the confidence then to actually win can he actually take the the reins and go on with it That's it's quite an intriguing battle really who's going to stand up here from uh, Nalbandian it was well telegraphed though by Lou Nalbandian saw it coming but that's the most amount of uh, energy and enthusiasm we've seen from him yeah, five games to four Nalbandian in the third set Nalbanyan leads. Five games. It's 5-4 Nalbanyan. Could easily have been 5-3. Lou. But he just uh, got a bit shaky on a couple of points there and allowed Nalbanyan to get the break back. Hold his own serve. And so it's uh, the pressure on the Taiwanese player now serving at 4-5. 15 off. It's backhand here going over the high part of the net down the line. Really missing it by quite a bit. Search it up. Not the two, not the start he wanted. Albanian. of the last shot here is the good balance at full stretch he really has good control over his body there It's sort of a little similar to the last time Lou served. 
He's going along fine in, he, in the game, leading in he, on his own serve, then started, just made a couple of, made an error there. Good shot from Nalbandian and pressure back on the Taiwanese player. had all the luck at the net. Such a fault. Oh, yes, he's made a good play. He's come in on, done all the right things and then has hit a lucky one at the end to win the point. Set point. Be the best point he's played in the match when you take in the, the importance of the of the point as well absolutely terrific Second set point, just forced to go for a little too much, Lou. in that last game as well and yet uh, it's Nalbandian who's come through and won the set can he go on and win the match well if I was a betting man you'd have to get put your money on him now two sets to one up he's the favorite he's finally hit the lead and uh, I think Lou's throwing everything Charlie. that he knows at him and is down two sets to one. Coming up on two and a half hours of play in this match for three sets of tennis. And, uh, as I said a few moments ago, it's been a long, hard road. But now Bandian finally is in front, two sets to one. It's taken a long time for it to drag himself up by the bootstraps, as it were. Last couple of games of that uh, third set producing the best tennis from both players. 
15 ans. That's the fourth ace of the match for now, Bandian. Thirty off. Interesting to see with uh, the tension and the occasions taking uh, the physical uh, drain on the uh, on Lou here. Oh. He's built like a road runner. He is, and he's played eight five set matches. He has a 5 3 winning record in five set matches. They would have been in Davis Cup. And uh, so he knows how to manage the distance. For service. Three sets gone. Total points one, a hundred for Nal Bandian, ninety seven for Lou. Satchel. Well, he's come out firing, Lou. Or aggression. with the angle that the fact that he did miss hit it oh, geez, that's... he's come up with a, a, really a miracle shot here and uh, look at that how acute a lot of wrist in that a lot of racket hit speed Certainly has sparked Lou into some action here. This is the most aggressive game I think he's played in the match. Hitting the ball hard, moving on to the shot. He was attacking. I suppose as a miss goes, it wasn't too bad. He was trying to do something. Yes. Probably seeing a case here that he thinks he's uh, in, obviously he's in trouble, two sets to one down, and he's decided to have a bit of a swing now. He's got nothing to lose. Exactly. Let's for service. A lot more to lose for Nalbandian, although in a much more comfortable position now, leading two sets to one. serve for Lou just in this hitting oh, area is. hardly has to move at all and uh, swings right through the forehand that's a beauty
Yes. It's be a good game for Nalbandian to hold here because Lou's thrown everything at him, played some terrific points. Nalbandian can withstand that attack because he has lost his opening serve of two of the three sets that have been played. He's going, to, he's going to challenge. He's going to challenge the call on the right facade. It was very close. Break point if he's right. Call was out. Ball was out. Ah, advantage. Nobody. Surface A seals the game for Nalbandian. One love in the fourth. First game, fourth set. Mr. Lou has two challenges remaining. Well, that's like reading your opponent's mind that served then because uh, Lou was jumping around there to play a forehand in the backhand corner and, uh, and it was almost Nalbandian may have seen him out of the corner of his eye then because going then for the big serve down the middle, he really uh, caught him out badly. A little bit more spark in the match now. End of that third set and uh, that game there. A lot more fireworks. Good attacking play from Lou. And uh, now Bandian rising to the, to the occasion. Wrong footing. His opponent there, Lou, looking for the open court playing in the open court, just going the wrong way. In fact, if he swung his racket, he probably could have connected there. Maybe he's hoping it was going out. an attempt at it, 15, but not yeah. good enough to beat Nalbandian with the classic uh, high backhand. Good movement too in that rally from Nalbandian. You know, I always think Nalbanian's a good mover when he's confident and uh, he started to gain some confidence now. I like the way he bends his knees, particularly with the forehand. It's a good lesson for players out watching the telecast.
Yes. Well, that's good tactics from Lou there. He's in trouble, putting the pressure on, coming in, said, all right, come up with a big pass if you can. Two break points saved. First of all. Surviving break points here at the outset of the fourth set. New balls, please. One game. Yes, we've been asking the question, uh, can Lou find another another level? I think he has. He's, uh, as Nalbandian has improved, so has Lou. A very, a very strong game then. Put the pressure on... Uh, Albany to come up with some passing shots, served a big ace at Juice. Albany and going for a new racket. That's the cheer squad for uh, Lu Yen Su. Just um, throwing that ball a little bit low that time, pulling it down into the net. Instead of reaching up and hitting up and through the ball. That's what we had weren't seeing early in the match. 30-15. That aggressive forehand and uh, quite a difficult shot. Deep ball returned by Lou and yet uh, Albandian came up with the winner. Interesting is now that Lou has started to play a little bit more attacking, hit the ball a bit harder, it seems to have lifted Nelbandian as well. Players like the ball to come onto them. Yeah, two sets to one, two games to one, Nelbandian. The slugfest continues.
But they've been out there for two hours and 45 minutes, this pair. And now Bandian has struggled mightily. And maybe not in vain. Take your seat quickly, please. Two sets to one, Thank two you. games to one. But he seems to be uh, doing a lot better now than uh, in the first set and a half. Out. 15 off. It's an overrule, I think. Yes, it is. He didn't have to challenge. Uh, he would have, uh, Lou, if there hadn't been the overrule. He makes this look so easy. He just uh, hits through the ball, takes it early, gets the racket head following the ball. Good timing. Fault it off. service game for the Taiwanese player to all two games off yes we got a good start in that game that's what it uh, it's important the first point in these uh, particularly for the serve it gives them that that confidence in and it's a long way back the first point or two for the returning player where the equation changes a bit now by that double fault. Lou has love 15. And the burden on uh, Albandian increases exponentially. Set it up, of course. Now Bandian out of position. Fifteen, thirty. Play this time, Lou. drop shot and uh, now Bannion made his ground well here he goes over the low part of the net over the middle surprisingly doesn't come up with it two break points for Lou Let's 
game lead. And a break in the fourth set in favour of Lu Yen Sun, three games to two. Lu leads, three games. And the last thing Albanian would want would be to be out here for five sets. He's the hot favourite, but he's uh, not been running hot in Albandian. Lou serving at 3-2 in the fourth. And with a real positive attitude about his play. Yes, we saw Lou uh, a little bit nervous, I felt, when he was in front in the third set, just tightened up and made some errors, but at the moment he's hitting freely and he's in front. Makes good ground here, gets right round the ball, gets his body out of the road so he can hit that off forehand. Service games, Lou. Four two ahead. Lou leads. Four games to two. That was a particularly good game for him. Good positive game. Took the match up to Nalbandian. No unforced errors. Good solid play. Lou with 35 winners. <laughs> 